What is going on guys, Capsino here, bringing you a League of Legends commentary. And today I have some uh, Lux gameplay for you. Um, probably, it's as you probably may know, uh, Lux is one of my favorite champs in the whole game. Uh, one of my favorite mid laners. Uh, and I have a new skin for her actually, uh, which I got for a mystery gift. Uh, from a friend and it's actually I bought RP for myself for the first time as well um, to buy some mystery skins or whatever so I'm actually gonna get the first blood here pretty quickly uh, I'm gonna flash right after there pop the ignite and get a last basic attack to uh, get that kill so that is gonna be I think that was first blood I'm not sure uh, Shape is gonna try to gank me, but uh, he's gonna take a lot of damage. So, as you can see, it, it was really, really lucky because, I mean, in a mystery uh, box or mystery skin gift, whatever you wanna call it, there's a big chance you can get like anything, and that I got luck, so it's really, really, really lucky. Look at this fail. I'm just gonna miss my ult. She's gonna, or he's gonna flash over my E, and that was just terrible, but. This ult is gonna sustain him that and get him the kill. But it was really lucky that I got a luck skin. Um, it's a pretty cool, cool skin, but it's kind of like Pulse Fire Estrel. It, it gets a little bit mainstream and uh, overused when it comes out because it's so fancy that you kind of get tired of it. Uh, but I don't really care. A luck skin is a luck skin, and it was. I'm happy for it. So Swain is gonna get caught here in my combo, and I'm gonna be no. Actually, Nocturne is gonna kill, steal that fucking kill. Uh, what a bastard! And I'm gonna skip forward right there uh, once again because this is this game is pretty slow in the beginning. Uh, Swain is gonna get a little bit greedy. He's gonna stand at the turret, and I'm gonna get a full combo again. One shotted, bitch. And I'm gonna push down the turret right there. Shake is gonna come here for some more kills uh, for me right there, and uh, I'm gonna get a double buff. Uh, meanwhile, Nocturne gets the dragon, and that is awesome. We're gonna push down for a bot turret right here, and uh, Draven is gonna pick up two kill or one kill. And the turret. Oh, I'm really, really tired. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Siobhan is gonna get, get a kill right there. And she's gonna chase me here, I think. Uh, no, look at this. Siobhan is gonna chase me. I'm gonna have to flash. Jax comes in for the teleport. And he's like, what the fuck are you doing, Lux? Don't leave me. But, you know, if I stayed, I would have died too. But he, he's kind of stupid. This game, I think. If I recall. Uh, anything of this game. This game is actually pretty old, or not that old, but it's not one of my recent games. Um, because I kind of tend to save some gameplays, or I, I've done that a little bit in the past. Uh, and so I can use them later for commentaries and stuff. I'm gonna snipe Karma right there, beautiful double kill right there, and we're gonna win the fight, turn the game around in our favor so I've been watching a lot of Breaking Bad lately have you seen that show it's like the best thing ever it's my best de decision in life watching that show I didn't know what it was first uh, but I saw like uh, a lot of Facebook posts about it and I heard from people who have watched it and they said it was great, so I just had to watch it. I, I've never really watched a f whole TV show like that, so that was probably my first, to be honest. But Breaking Bad is great. If you haven't watched Breaking Bad, just go ahead right now and do it. It's so exciting. So I pretty much benched watched the whole thing in um, a couple of weeks. It's like 62 episodes, and I just watched it all. Unfortunately, 
I spoiled like two things for myself while watching uh, a Breaking Bad video before finishing the whole show. And then I, I read the comments and there was a guy, a douchebag, an idiot, that posted a comment with like all the major spoilers in the whole, uh, throughout the whole series. Um, so that that's just sad. I saw two big spoilers uh, before I closed the internet browser. But you know, it's sad when people spoil things. But for me, I I, would, I can still watch the show and you know enjoy it anyway, even if I probably knew what was gonna happen. Um. So that's nice, but definitely watch Breaking Bad if you haven't already. Just watch it uh, all in a row. It's th the best TV show ever. I haven't watched many TV shows, so I'm probably not the best guy to say that. But if you look on IMDb, a uh, film site, or uh, yeah, a movie and film TV series site, it has 9.6 out of 10, and that's the best rating on the whole website so definitely go and watch that show you will not regret it um it's kind of sad it's kind of a comedy in the beginning and not a comedy but it's it's funny in the beginning but then it gets uh kind of darker and darker throughout the whole series so when it's gonna get out luckily out of my combo right there and we're actually gonna head out from here uh, caitlin also gets lucky there uh, yeah, what I build on Lux, I go with a very standard build, I use this build probably every game that I play with Lux, almost no exceptions. The first item you should always, ru always rush, or not always, sometimes you should rush another item. You should rush either Sonya's or Athene's. Okay, the reason why you sh sometimes should rush Sonya's if it's maybe not rush Sonya's but rush uh, that uh, Seeker's arm guard that gives you armor and stuff. If you're playing versus like K6 or Sed or something like that in mid lane, you really really need to rush armor because if you rush Athene's which is magic resist, it's gonna be pretty useless in lane. You do buy it for the uh, mana regeneration a lot too, but. Rushing magic resist, it's it's not good. Uh, Nocturne is or Nocturne is gonna get a mid inhibitor. Jax is gonna get the top one. Uh, we're gonna get the dragon. So um, Athens, and then you can go for Morella Nomicon, which is for uh, mana regeneration as uh, cooldown reduction. You wanna have 40% cooldown reduction. That's full cooldown reduction. That's the most cool cooldown reduction you can have. Uh, and you get that from just buying those two items so uh, and they're pretty easy to get because you know the small parts of those items uh, co doesn't don't cost a lot of uh, gold so uh, Athens then Morella Nomicon then you can get Rabadon uh, or Sonya's depending on what kind of game you're playing uh, definitely the um, magic pen boots never cool that reduction boots it's not worth it trust me get those if you get Morella Nomicon and Athens you will get 40% cooldown reduction and you don't need anything more than that trust me because that's the cap so those four or five items and last item uh, is gonna be the void staff uh, when you play Luxy Pox really underrated champion you don't see her lot in ranked uh, but you should definitely go try her if you haven't probably have but she's awesome I can carry most games with her because she's OP as shit really good for solo queue thanks for watching don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next video hopefully soon I haven't been uploading a lot lately but whatever peace